I want you to think about the story of Noah's Ark. The wickedness of the world was so great that uh, God destroyed it by water, but he provided an ark for the salvation of those who believed in him. They were saved by going through the waters. In fact, take a look at, with me uh, at First Peter. This is a really interesting passage. It's one of those hard texts, if you like. First Peter chapter 3 and from verse 20. It says here about the ark. In it, only a few people, eight in all, were saved through, were saved through water. And this water symbolizes baptism 